G'day everybody and welcome back to Reactive Gaming with Chris and James and welcome back to the Sons of the Forest. We are back here for part two of the Ultimate Beginners Building Guide. We are going to be continuing on the defense part at the front of this building for this episode and we will probably start on the actual construction of the building. Um, first things first, we are going to be continuing the spikes along this sort of the perimeter here. It's still a weak point. If you've got your structure damage on, they're still going to be able to beat through here, even though you got all that defenses there. Although, admittedly, if they do beat through, they're going to get chopped up anyway. But yep. we don't want them to destroy our base. So we're going to put up some stuff. I'm going to go and get a few traps now, James. Yep. So the first one I'm going to get is probably the spin trap. I'm going to put in the coordinates. It's nice and quick. I'm going to leave a link in the video as well for everybody if they want to go check out the uh, find all 11 blueprints. Now, I know there are 15 now. But these ones are your basic ones for all your traps and lamps and all that sort of stuff. But yeah, I'll put a link up here for you. First one we need is the spin trap. Yep. That's the one we got. Beautiful. Need that one. All right. I'm going to get the grinder next. Okay. We are at the second one. This one here is for the grinder. Should I go and get the uber trap as well? well I'm always a big fan of that. Oh, that's cool. Got one of the um, artifacts here as well. Oh, cool. Yep. That's always handy. Oh, stop looking at the artifact. I can't see what I'm doing. Give okay. me my torch. There we go. Okay, we're going to go move over to the Uber trap. Okay, and this is the last one that I needed. Was probably the Uber trap. Uh, where is it? I can't see it. Am I blind? Let me try that command again. Oh, I think they moved it. It's not there anymore, James. Oh, okay. All right. Um... We're going to have to make a new video. Disregard that. Don't watch that video. Because it's changed. Okay, two seconds. I hate when they do that. That's alright, doesn't matter. I'm just going to come back to the base. We'll start working what we got. Yep, alright. Okay, we are back. So let's start doing some traps. We're definitely going to need one over here, James, at the front door. Yeah. Definitely okay. want one there. And we need to do that quickly. Okay, that is done. Now, this is where we're going to need Calvin. Where is he? Is he Has he turned up or not? I haven't seen him. Is he still on the beach where we left him? Yeah, we. I never I never um, uh, prompted him or activated him. Oh, me. Do you want me to go down and grab him? Nah, we'll get him soon. We'll get him soon. Okay. So where do you want this other one? Um, Next one, we'll go there. Where you're standing in here? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, about there. Yep. Okay. You want to put one in the one. corner here? Just in uh, case. Yeah, yeah, in the corner if you want. Yep. Yeah. Okay, I got what you're doing. Yeah. All right, I'll go hop out and... Just going to put them all over the damn place. Now, you can still yeah. walk through nice and easily. Yeah. But they ain't going to be coming through. We're going to test no. them in a second. No. They won't get past the first one. They will not go past the first one. This is really re redundant that we're doing this. The, um... But just in case. Just in case. Why can't I... I'm trying to rem um, take... To uh, what they call it, um... Uh... Logs off this, this what's going call it out here, log holder, and it won't let me. Oh, hey, <laughs> hey, shit. Oh, come on, buddy. Come in here. Those explosives, I didn't realize they were there. There we go. That's what we wanted to see. No more head for you. <laughs> come on in. Come on in. Oh, I forgot I don't have God mode on. Oh. A little help, please. Coming. <laughs> it killed me, the trap, as well. Oh, my God. 
Ah, oh, well, you know it's effective. Yeah. Yeah, I'm done. Yep. Thanks. Killbox works. Killbox works. Let's get some god mode on. Yep. So, yeah. Perfect, man. Beautiful. Perfect. All right, that's what we want. Added the base fare up to that um, explosion. Looks like it's okay. I forgot I had that line of um, grenade um, yeah. uh, traps yep. there. Nice. All right. I think that'll do for that front bit. You got the spikes up, so that's going to be like... Yeah. Yeah. They're not getting too far in. They'll probably get up no. here, though. Then they can probably Have get, you got um, log hack on? Uh, no, I don't. Can you try and take some more build up? So you can do it. Yeah. You're using X. How are you? I... There you go. All right. Thank you. You're welcome. And, um... All right, we're going to start on the... The actual base now. So we're just yeah. going to do something very, very simple. Just a little A-frame, something that looks a bit stylish. We're going to use stone for the foundation. So the actual, like, walls. And then we're going to have to go to wood for the actual bit of the frame. What I need is a stone first. We're going to go one and a quarter high to start with. Yep. This will give you the nice height. You're not going to feel claustrophobic. We're going to go four, five, six. We'll go four. Four should be enough. So one, two. Should be pretty much center, I believe. Close enough. Four by four. Yep. Sounds good. Beautiful. I missed one. Okay, that's going to be nice and easy. So the reason we're laying it like this to begin with is to get that... You sort of your one and a quarter high. So you've got to lay it like that. Once you've done that, you could build up to your normal height. Let's quickly fill these in. Give you oh. that, that good angle. That yeah. angle that you need. The roof. The uh, one quarter start of it. Yeah, well, you just don't want it too low. Mm. Oops. Whoopsie. Oh, my God. That's why I hate using more than one stone. It just ends yep. up becoming a problem. Uh, now, where are we going to put our door? Probably just right here, I reckon. We'll take that away so we've got no doorway. Okay. And then just going to keep doing that. So I'm just going to quickly fill all this in. I'll be back in a sec. Okay, the walls are all done. We're going to start thinking about where we're going to be placing our fireplace as well. So another good reason why to do one and a quarter starting from the bottom is you could build James's famous uh, fireplace. Fireplace, yeah. I'm thinking we're going to do it on the end here. So downstairs, we usually like to make like a kitchen dining area. Upstairs is going to be more of a living space. So what I am going to do is... Oops, too many stones. Just need one. One, then go across. I've had a lot of requests for this uh, fireplace yeah. to be done again. So I thought, why not? Let's do it again. Actually, it doesn't matter. We need to fill that in. Okay. So leave everything open except for the front. Sorry. Close everything up except for the front. You close up the sides. It's better off to close off the sides first. Because if you don't place the fireplace properly, you won't be able to do the walls. You're going to tear it all down. All right. Let's get ourselves a fireplace. All right. So we're going to get this sort of straight. It's hard to get this fireplace straight. But if you look straight down at it, you should be able to see... What is straight? Ah, so hard. Okay. That's going to have to do. And just bring it up till the front is sort of sticking out a little bit like that. And I shouldn't have instant book build it. Sorry. Tear that down. I'm going to turn instant book build off. 
because it will not work like that. Let's go back and try that again. About there should do. That looks about right. Let's just get your rocks. Uh, actually, you just need one. And just stand back until you can see the lines. See the lines there in front of you? I'll move it so you can see a little bit better. When you can see that, then start filling in the wall, not the fireplace. And then you can go through and fill up the actual fireplace itself. I should have put some book build on. Done. It takes about 35 stones to fill one of them, so... Yeah. Now we've got the wall behind it. You're going to see the prompts here. Cut those out. Now you have a fireplace built in. I should have brought it forward a little bit. Oh no, that's not it. That's because of the wall. Never mind. Uh, we'll quickly fill in the bottoms. And we could do that all the way around the base. Normally do that last though. But just fill those in first. And from there, we are going to chuck some sticks in there. Uh, we need a... Just a log. You can put shutters on it. I'll show you in a second. Oops. I lit it up too early. We've got that prompt there. That opens it up like that as well. Chuck that in there. Now you got yourself a decent little fireplace. Nice. Like it? Nice. Yep. James's idea. Comes yep. Up, comes up real good. And just close the shutters once you're finished with it. There you go. Bloody awesome. Bloody lovely, mate. Bloody lovely. Yep. Now we're going to start thinking about some stairs and we've got to actually support the roof now. Okay, cool. so we're going to be building a staircase now. We're going to do it out of wood because, to be honest, it's a lot easier. It takes way less um, resources. Can you do me a favor and get me a half log, please, James? Yep, half you on the way. And just support that up for us. Yep. So once you get it like that... No, no, over here, mate. Over here, under these ones. Under these? Under the stairs. Oh, yeah. Oh, actually, hang on. Yeah, no, good point. Go back and chuck it under there for me, please. We're going to do a little bit of a floating staircase while we got it here. Yeah. Take them out. We don't even need this here. Oh, hang on. Leave it in there just in case. No, no, we won't need it. All right. I won't need it. And we're going to attach like them like that. that. Way better than having oh, all these easy. logs underneath. Too easy. Beautiful. And uh, we could put one up here through there. Chuck some stairs on it. Oh, oh get, jeepers. Get planks on it. <laughs> How easy is that? That's a nice Look little that. easy staircase. All right. So now we've got to... So if you didn't see what I did there... All right, yep. You need to make sure this is supported or whichever one is supported. And then it'll give you the option to go down on an angle once you've had it, you know, once the actual pillar is gone from here. And that'll work for you. What are you doing there? Oh, yeah, we're doing the... Um, yeah, I'm doing the height thing. Got to do the roof now. Yeah, yeah, the ceiling. All right, oh. Are we doing that in timber? Yep. On the way in. Timber's easy. And let's do it like that. Like that. One more and here. Oh, we need a half here, don't we? So I can... Just a quarter. Just there will do. A quarter? Yep. Where'd you say where? Quarter here. Uh, right here in the middle. Yep, gotcha. That's it. Okay, and a half here we need. Oh, or the log uh, supports. Beautiful. One, two. That's uh, done, that's done. Chuck and a few supports in each. You don't have to when they're two or three wide. 
Can't, can't hurt. Yeah. Can't hurt. Let's get all these supports out. Alright, so, and then we just need a fully over the back there, and that's it. Get rid of these ones here. You got a fully uh, there? Oh, are you doing it? Yep. yep. Beautiful. And let's okay. whack some floors down. Oi. I wouldn't go any further than that for your stairs, otherwise you're going to start hitting your head on them. You can take it back as far as you need to. That's about right there. I normally like to take it all the way back. And it's covered. Um, we're going to leave this area here open for the fireplace. So as soon as we go upstairs, it's going to be all done. Couldn't we... Could we put a fireplace upstairs? Oh, hell yeah. Too, yeah. And put it in the spot and just let it go up. That's it. In the same... It'll go through the roof. Yep. But... It doesn't matter, it's going to act like a chimney. But yeah. we're still going to have a fireplace here. So ideally, I'd like to do something normally a little bit bigger than this. But, you know, it's up to you how big you want to make it. It's, yeah. We're just yeah. doing a quick example on how we build um, something like the A-frame. is giving you a bit of an example. Okay, so now the fun part, James. All right, I need a full log. Where's the full log? There's full log. The A-frame. Very, He's very, very easy. One log there, one log there, one log there. Just repeat the process. Um, so what we need to do is get Water this log. going across. Quarter log is going to go just on top of that one there. That one there. This will give you that nice, steep pitch. And then what we do is we just raise it up like that. And we essentially have finished the A-frame. Does that need to go up another quarter? Yeah. 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 Thought so. But what we'll do is we'll... We need to do we'll it from here. Up. Yeah. Yep. So once we get this all sort of replicated... Alright, I need a pulley. And that'll go like that. Okay. We're going to get another full log just there and then what we could do is put another quarter log on top of that one and do the exact same thing pop it up there and then we'll have to put one there as well but we can make that easier so now we got a proper A-frame going now, before you take any scaffolding down, I would start thinking about your lighting. If you're going to be using light bulbs, don't fill anything in. You can do the roof, but don't fill anything in, in between. All right, that's um, that's pretty much it for the A-frame part of it. Why am I stuck? That's how we're going to get our roof. Now, what we're going to do is actually put a bit of a overhang on it. You Did want you? me to do the... Um, sorry. Yeah, what? You want me to do the um the uh second level fireplace out of stone? Yeah, definitely. We'll do yeah, that in right. a second. Okay, we're gonna start removing the inside of the scaffolding now. So what I want to do is just put supports in all under here. Don't really need to do the top one, but the bottom one definitely. We're gonna quickly do that one there. That one there. Don't need to worry about that one or that one. This one possibly. Oh, I'm missing a log. Oh dear. What's up? Nah, all good. Fixed it. Do you want I'm on the front? No, we don't because that'll come all the way out, won't it? Because it's up top, yep. Yeah. Alright. Alright, we can start taking these out now. Uh, that one's supported, that one's supported. This one needs to be done. No, it actually doesn't. That'll come out. That's good, that's good. Okay. These should just start coming out. Now, because it's under five spans long, these come out with no problems. 
Oh, you know what I need to do. I'm gonna take off the top off first. Are you already done it? Cool. These could come out. Put that one back for a second. And those ones can come out. like this. I don't know why you're messy. spitting logs. I know, I, I just don't understand. I, it's just not my MO. It's weird how the game's doing that now. Yeah. Ah, oh, well. That's all good. Oh, well, yeah. And then right. we can start filling in all the walls and bits and pieces as well. Get these corners in, and then we could cut windows if needed. And gonna start planking. There's too much going on here. Alright, um. Alrighty. This one here done here. That one there, that one there. Oh, hang on. Oh, do you want. We gotta leave one side open. So we can put light bulbs in. Oh, I'm yeah, okay. We could do that at any time, though. You could literally just pl tear up some of the planks if needed. Right, I need to do finish my. And the roof is done. Beautiful. Nice and easy. Only a tiny little place, but it's good. We're going to have a nice window coming up here. I'm going to cut out a couple of windows for you to see out of. We're going to get ourselves a little quarter log. Chuck them in there. They act as little shutters. And that's a cozy little place. How are you going with your um, fire pit? I'm just doing the outside chimney. Uh huh. And then I'll get onto the, the uh, fireplace. Just closing in the. No worries. I'll do the fireplace quickly for you then, eh? Yep, if you like, mate, please. Alrighty, fireplace is done. Yeah, there will be a fair bit of stuff left over, James, but that's going to be good for gardens and stuff. Yeah, yeah. You could do it like a barn in here if you wanted to. You can do whatever you want. Yeah, that's there's so plenty good. of room. Okay. Actually, I already had a cut-up piece. Probably I'll disappeared already. Oh well. I'm gonna cut a new piece up. Nothing seems to be coming in at this point. Or shouldn't be. Yeah. It's this is what you call easy easy uh, building when you don't have to worry about the um the locals. Yep, that's it. Your best bet is just to keep on the water. If you stay on the water, you're always going to be safe. Let's go check out our food. Okay, that still needs dry aging. We do have some fish, though. You have some fish? We got Good some fish. Got heaps of fish. Plants are slowly starting to grow, too. Cool. I'm going to start filling in the bottoms of the... building. Yep. Um, Finding that right angle, though, eh? Yeah. Nice little chimney. Nice little builds. Looks good. Yep. All right, mate. We're going to have to leave it here today. Yep. We're going to continue with the build tomorrow. I think what we need to do is a little garden out here. What do you reckon? Yeah, yeah. We need to start yep. thinking about that sort of stuff. Yep. 
there's um, certainly a lot of room left to do little things. Uh, We've still got like, to fill the inside of the little home as well. Yep. There's a lot to do, but we'll get there, definitely. Alrighty, we're going to leave the video there for today. If you liked the video, consider giving us a thumbs up, and if you can, please like and subscribe and leave a comment down below. That would be awesome. We'll see you on the next one. Bye.